and welcome back to another episode of God damn it, what's it called again? I don't know, you guys can actually name it. But don't get it wrong. Anyway, we are back. So I got my 15 plates. So fear the 15 plates. And we'll get them in and we go one of them. And then we want one of them. And one of them. We have all the presses. I am quite happy about that. Um, we wanted this press to be first. So. And we need power. Power, power. And we need one of them and one of them. So, as these don't draw that much power. Oops. We should be good. So. I know, I was playing with you, seeing if you would notice what I was doing. Really? Ah, because it needs to be a relay. God damn it. Um. One of them, and one of them. Hmm. That's a good question. No, because it has to be that to come out, so I need a relay. Let's put the relay right here. Uh, well, that, I actually built that right in the center. How awesome! I didn't even notice that. So there, to there, and there, to I can place them on the roof. <laughs> oh no way! That's hilarious. Uh, I wonder if actually things get stuck to it. Come on, break! Oh, that is that is just comical. I'm sorry, but that is, I, that's quite funny. It's like do do do. Let's just run a things across the roof upside down. Uh, that's good. So that is still powering up. Now, after all that, I wanted to make uh, a dynamo. I know I had it in the list there. So we need eight of them, which requires four of them, and that's pretty much it. So this actually is quicker. So throw them in there. Oh, that only gives us two, doesn't it? So that will only be for one stick. We'll need another two. Yeah, that's all I should need actually. So that only gave us four, and we needed eight. But instead of having to worry about cutting it, now this works. I will produce another two of these, and then there will be um, metal plates, metal gears. So we can do it that way. And then I can automate it through applied line logistics or who else. And then we need two sticks. And there is our four. We need some iron, oops, which we do have. So we just do that, and that, and then two of them. There is our kinetic dynamo for our windmill, and everything else that we require. This ender pouch is quite good, but I would like an ability to upgrade it, because that would make it so much easier. But alas, that's okay. So now we're going to go out here, I actually should get some, I should be putting that away actually, and that, 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 there. So let's grab 64 of these. I know I travel, you can travel on the edges, but I just want to make sure by filling these out. So what do we end up with now? we still got our pig, our sheep, so we don't quite have enough yet. You can get eggs from buying them from Pam's marketplace so that's the other way to get it or you build this and hope for your best so let's count here so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 so I made it even god damn it 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 so here so if I die, 
are my own fault. Uh, how am I going to get down? This shouldn't kill me, so... We'll go all the way up as high as we can. And then we will place a platform behind it. Because we want to make sure we put it on right. So that's the wrong way. And I'll put my engineering hammer away. Derp. But that is the right way. And I can place it like that. Awesome. So now that is working. So that's technically nothing in front of it. And it doesn't say how many I'm actually powering. So. Hey cow! Catch! Boom! <laughs> and I generate all that back. So there's that is generating. Um, now I don't know how much loss I actually get from my wiring, but I don't have any. I could make some. Um, cause if I do that, I'll have to come across and then come down. I think I might just grab all my. Hmm. I could either hardened or lead stoned. So I actually might do lead. That might be a bit easier. Now I need to get back up there. I'll just climb up and then break it on the way down. So because I will have it, the wire coming down the back, down here. Oh, I wonder, can I stand on this? Well. And there we go. That is producing some power. But that isn't fully upgraded because I will be upgrading that to the hemp ones. So I'll come back up here again. That's okay. Uh, hopefully the cow will catch me. Nope. Cow can't catch. So that is a nice little... What do you call it? Nice little power generation. I'm building this just for testies. So I want to see what it is like. I think uh, one more across. And that looks about right. Let's see. This will... Oh, 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 crap. That's going to kill me. Come on, regenerate, 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 regenerate. Oh, yeah! Yes! I didn't die! Death is scared of me. Run away, little Deathy! Run away! Ah, uh, Rice Soup Saves the Day. That's the title now of this one is Rice Soup Saves the Day. So if you guys watch this, you're going to have funny. You're just going to laugh at me. Have funny. Well done, Wayne. Eh? <gasps> Scared the crap out of me, though. I'm like, whoops, I meant to hold shift there. And here. The only problem with this one. up and not falling off again. Oh, I have run out of leadstone. Oh, well, on to harden. That's fine. It won't produce that much power anyway. So, but if I make more power over this way, I'll have a running line. We'll just come down this way. And there we go. Um, 
Hmm, actually, I didn't want that way, did I? Ah, uh, because I want it being charged up. So I got ahead of myself a little bit too much. So we want it uh, input there. So we can have two input sides. I I guess I could have put it there and moved that to the side, but that's no biggie. I'll probably end up changing it later anyway, because when I make my reactor, so there we go. So now we should be getting a nice boost in power. I really would like to know what it's actually the income is, but you can't tell in RF, unfortunately. So there we go. Um, yeah. Now we need to upgrade it, the windmill, to have. Uh, oh, it did actually work. To have hemp seeds. There's something wrong, it's not telling you everything like zero. That oh, it's durability, They're actually not used to it should tell you still the usage of it. So okay, let's see if this works. Nope. Too quick. Now I don't know how many I need, so Really, I didn't do that. Uh, single tap, and it still does that. See? Single tap, and it breaks it. This is going to be a pain in my butt. I can see this coming. Look at me go! I'm smashing it! <laughs> Double entendre. Okay, so, uh, so let's look at windmill. It will give us this, this. So it needs quite a few of them per... I think it's per blade. We'll find out when we try and attach it. So we'll make five. So that's eight. <coughs> um, what's that? Six. So... 8 times 6, yeah, 48, so we should be able to make it, so, like this, now the question is, is it 1 or does it need to be all? So that is it. It upgrades the one sail. So I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more. That is actually gone really fast, eh, because of the wind. That is really cool. I like that.
And I like the individual upgrade of the windmills too, so I'm quite happy with this windmill as another passive. So, and technically you could have them in a line. So that's pretty cool, so I'll make more. So this won't be enough. So what did I say it was? 48 times 7. So the total is 336 of these. And divide that by... 64 five and a half stacks so we'll be just farming along to get some more of these see you can't just right click these it just yeah Does that. that is so annoying. I don't know why, but Minecraft it double randomly just double clicks when you're trying to do some stuff. So I don't know why, but all my mouse do it, and they are all different type of mouse mice over different computers. Uh, so unless it's just overuse of gaming could be. So we have three stacks so that's coming along nicely. Whoops that one was my bad. I misclicked. So let's get this one cranking. Correctly again. All these seeds. Oh, did I break my potato? There you go. Be fully grown. Okay, so we are at nearly what we require. Five and a half stack. Oh, wait, no. Really? What are we at now? Sixty-four with nearly half a stack. leave it there, we will grab the sticks, let's do that, do that, spread it out, and a little bit too many over but we now have a full stack Oops. Of them. So we can quickly just go BAM upgrade and be like yay and watch this thing spin so quick it comes off the dynamo and then slaughters let's say the sheep and the cow there. Yep, that's perfect. Nice ending to the day. So can I just click? And it goes mental! Um, I, uh, 213 RF a tick at the current time. That's what it's taking in by the look of it. That is so much quicker than that down there. But it is raining and, yeah, it is pulling in 213 RF a tick. So that actually isn't too bad. So our little play around in with the wind mill of thermal expansion, or immersive, uh, god damn it, I keep getting mixed up in the mod packs, yeah, the immersive engineering, 
Now that is smashing along. Look at that. That is just hammering beautifully. That is really good. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, drown you, drown you people. Come on. Nah, there must be enough witches in there. Twenty-six buckets of blood. Now that's what I'm talking about. Now that will fill up. Oh, looks like my windmill's slowing down a bit. But that's okay. We can see how much it's pumping in. So it's dropped down to 106. So that's not too bad. So in a storm it's really really handy. Um, it wasn't actually that hard to make. Uh, the dynamos I think were the hardest thing out of the lot really. But that was because of we went off and did the other things. But I guess we could do a couple of them, three or four. That could be you know 400 a tick. That's actually not too bad. Um, could always go back and do the water mill, but the water mill is, <coughs> yeah, it, you need to set it up properly, you need to have like one there, then another water source blocks down here, and uh, two more at the back to get like 88 RF a tick, 61 at the moment, so that's not too bad, that is not too bad, that line can stay, so we did quite well, let's check out see if we've got any blue we got two. Oh my god two ah oh, we're winning this war bro uh, and we don't have any more string it always it doesn't quite give you the right amount of string back it always misses some so we are down to 53 I mean I could always go get more string it's not that hard we got four of them left, so um, that's only two metal. I really need more, so I'm trying to get more. So I know I can actually automate this uh, by the um, uh, what do you call it? The drums and auto placing mechanical user. So we. If if I really want, I could do it that way, but, yeah. That's just, at the moment I don't really need it, it's just more time consuming. Thank you, Bessie. That gives me 61, so more than I need. <laughs> wow, this one's at 4.26 gig in size. Oh, did it again. Eight left over, and I accidentally used all of them, didn't I? Ah, well. We have spares for a reason. Put that in there. We at least we have heaps of hemp. Make sure we got. Okay, we have spares of them, and that will convert more into hemp oil, so we don't have to worry about it. Uh, and I don't think I actually need any more use for them. Strip curtain, jump cushion, interesting, and a balloon. I know with a balloon you can use it as a air block. You place it down and then you right click on it with it. So, but I don't think I will use them for a little while. So that's fine. But now, um, we got more power, so I'm happy. It is passive power, which I like the best. 
Um, but at the moment, it is generating some power, and that just looks awesome. I really love the look of that. So I might make another one later on. So because that that would be over 200 power a second, and that would generate enough. Um, bucket, bucket, bucket. Focus on the bucket, why not? So we have the metal press. So the rolling machine. Uh, I need to start in. In, 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 in astral sorcery. Now we need to palace you need to get know the basic of astrals. First you need to make a rock crystal ore through empowering to make it. So we need a rock crystal ore. I know there's two types. So we need to get this which is oh that's really easy. So we'll get uh, let's let's make sixteen of it. Oh no, uh, we only want four. Because that makes take that one, and then you need six, and then you break it and they give you. So this will be 16. So, one there, one there, one there, one there, and one there. Okay. No, I'm a noob. I'm a noob, I'm a noob, I'm a noob. the different animation that it's given it. That's pretty cool. <laughs> the last one. Bam. And there we go. I don't know why that did that. Okay. Oh, obsidian pickaxe. What? When? Why? How? When your powers combine. Wow. He put an obsidian pickaxe on it. Ah! Okay. Um, time to <laughs> upgrade to a better pickaxe. Um. Uh, should I just go straight ahead and just turn these three into a pickaxe? Cause. Ah. Uh, okay. Before I do that, let, let looks at. Let's look at the pickaxe here in Tinkers. So. Jagged, alien, rideable. I don't think this tells you mining level. I oh, yeah, stone, iron, cobalt, iron, diamond. So bronze, bronze pickaxe. Okay. So we need to make all the blank patterns first. So that will do. And then one of you to one of you is a stencil table. One of you to one of you is a part builder. And um, one of you and one of you is the pattern chest. Uh, there's one more I always forget to do. station and I need still one of you to one of you and that should be all four there is a part chest but I never really use it so 
Um, since I'm going to move the smeltery, I'm just going to build these over here because this is where the smeltery will end up. Um, because this both need lava, so the smeltery will probably be around here somewhere. Um, it, w it will move eventually, but at the moment it won't. I don't know how this goes. There they are, so that's all there. So, okay, put them in there. I want a head and I want a tool rod and a pattern. Um, shovel head. Uh, I don't even know what that is. That's a shard. Uh, you want an axe pattern. Don't think we need anything else of the bigger stuff just as yet. So put all them in there. Uh, this is incorrect because the part builder needs to be here. And that there. And the part builder, there we go. This will give us the binding, which actually meant to be paper if I want I won't do it out of paper just as yet this needs to be actually out of treated wood and I need some no gold and bronze to actually melt it down so uh, that's three patterns and this is this one here Actually, I'll grab these just in case. Uh, four. I'll grab six. I don't know if it's one or two. So, okay. It is wrapping up point in time, so I'm just going to end it here before continuing on. Uh, you will get the next episode. Um, um, yeah, so next episode I'll finish this off and you can watch me make my new Tinkerer's set uh, so you can laugh at me. But anyway, thanks for watching and um, the rice soup wins the day. Laters. <laughs>